So she says, what are we going to do today? Then I thought, how about, when do you lose your virginity? Oh. Oh, great and terrible Betty Dotson. <laughs> we, we did. I had, I had that question this week. Um, mm -hmm. I say we just let go of the term. It's ridiculous. What does it mean? You know, why, do you, why do you think a man wants a virgin? Because that way he doesn't have to compare his cock to any other cock. That's right. He can have a little. He can have a little dick, and he can come fast. And, and she doesn't know. She'll never know. No competition. So I think that virginity. Well, they'll, they're going to say it's because the man wants to know it's his, his spawn. He wants to make sure that the baby the woman has is his. But you never really know. Yeah. We make seventy-five cents on the dollar. Glass ceilings. We have to give birth. So it's just one of those things with being female. We always know it's our child, and you may not. And uh, yeah, and we, we may not even know who the father is either, but it doesn't well, matter. Well, that happens a lot. <laughs> I always have like, you know, spurts of sexual activity. Uh, and you just make, say, keep a list, keep a list, make dates. I always put it in my calendar. <laughs> if a woman is having an orgasm, if she's masturbating to orgasm and she's put her finger inside her vagina and she's played with her clitty. She's not a virgin anymore. No, you're not a virgin. You're, you're, you're a sexual woman. So we have to stop defining our sexuality with the male terms. Yes. Uh-uh. No. The men cannot and they're no longer allowed to define our sexuality. Now what about men? When they masturbate and ejaculate, are they virgins anymore? They're they're coming. They're they're <laughs> fully they're fully functional. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like if you're masturbating and you're having orgasms and ejaculations you're not a virgin. You're a sexual man. You're an orgasmic man. So, the, see, our focus is on procreation. Yes. Procre and that's not what sex is about. That is part of what sex is about. So, when I was waiting for you to put the camera on, I thought to myself, when did I lose my virginity? Maybe I'd open the clip by asking you that question, and we could talk about our first times. And I thought, when did I lose my virginity? And I thought about it. And it was camping with my family. I had the bunk in the top, so you're, you're right below the ceiling of the camper. And I was masturbating, touching myself, and fantasizing about Brian Cerise. I had a crush on him in, like, third grade. And I really felt like that's when I lost my virginity, and I had no idea you were going to do the clip, like, the way you just did. When you had an orgasm with yes, yourself. I had an orgasm fantasizing. There you go. That's one definition of, see, but we use the term virginity. It's, I want to get rid of it altogether. But, you know, it's, get rid of the penetration concept. It's the first time you have an orgasm with yourself. When did I lose my virginity? So if I'm thinking about penetration, I'm going, oh, well, it was probably when I was 11 years old and I used the jump rope. I knew you were going to say the jump rope. I was waiting for the jump rope. We wanted to see if you could put something in the hole. Of you know? course, of course. It's curiosity. Kids want to know. I remember doing it with my Barbie doll leg. Like I took the Barbie doll and went like this with her body. Oh, I'm sorry. We have to. <laughs> <laughs> we have to end this clip right we now. We have. We have to stop now. This. She's. You're getting pornographic, darling. Your Barbie doll legs. Well, it was kind of soft. It's kind of almost like a dildo, like a realistic. With like feet a... on the end of it. <laughs> <laughs> Cut. <laughs>